Previously on Factions. So right now we are at like the the walls of uh, of a torn down base. My brother is hiding underneath this base. Okay, drop in, boys, drop in. Let's do it. All right, Northwest, stick near these tables over here. You see these tables? Stick here. Oh no! Chill, chill here, chill here, chill here. Obsidian's underneath. Oh, yes, yes, yeah. yes! Fight, 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 fight! There's one here, one here. I got sister rusher. I got sister rusher. I got photo. Yes, it worked. <laughs> Lots of little battles happening. Ooh, my brother's gonna go right off. But goodbye, my brother. Goodbye. Hey, what's up, guys? Captain Rusher here. Welcome back to Factions, everybody. It's good to see you today. And thank you for tuning into this show every single day and making it your daily routine, 7 p.m. Eastern, or whichever time you, you tend to watch it at before bed in the morning. Whatever. Uh, it's the summertime. I know you got other things to do, but tuning into this series, this show, liking, commenting, sharing it with your friends helps expand it, and uh, it means the world to me. We put tons of time into these videos, and you guys putting in 20, 25 minutes watching the videos is is all I can ask. So thank you so much. Mitch, how the heck are you doing, buddy? Wahoo! Wahoo! Fantastic. That describes it perfectly. Wahoo! <laughs> Good to see you, Mitch. Uh, actually... It is really good to see you because... Thanks, man. You're heading off. Oh, okay. Here comes the sadness. Forever. I'm not going to tear up. No, tear no, up. don't worry. Oh. Don't worry. It's not bad, guys. Don't cry. Don't cry. Don't, don't cry. Don't cry. <laughs> um, so, Mitch is... You're gone for a little bit, though. You're heading on vacation. You're going to be gone from the Faction series for about two weeks, so 14 episodes or so. And uh, I'm really gonna miss you, bro. I am. Uh, we're gonna miss. I'm gonna miss you personally, of course. Mitch is my in real life friend, so we won't get to hang out for a little bit. But uh, I'll miss you too, bro. Yeah, I think the viewers will miss you. And uh, I got a couple. I actually have two daily factions comments of the day. They both involve you. Okay. Oh. <laughs> and I want to. Uh, I want to make. I'm nervous now. Uh, don't be too nervous. Don't be too nervous. So here we go. The first daily factions comment of the day comes in from Justin Collins. I honestly feel kind of bad for Mitch sometimes. I think he's a great part of factions and it would not be the same without him. Hashtag Mitch equals love you all Aww. rock. Aww. And Mitch, I completely agree, dude. Even though we, we rip on you all the time and, uh, you know, you're hilarious. You bring some awesome, awesome content to this show. And me, me included, I think everyone who watches this every single day or whenever they can, we all agree... We love you, dude. It's good to have you on the series. And, uh, you know, if you left, as in you're leaving for the next couple weeks, you know, it's noticeable. We, we miss you. We, we miss a couple good laughs. Uh, we don't die as much, but, you know. <laughs> dude, you're making me blush. Come on. Making a blush. Good, no. And now that we said that, now I'm going to, you know, because I just said something nice, I have to <laughs> counteract it. it. <laughs> so uh, the next Daily Factions comment of the day comes in from Josh Weaver. And uh, I'm actually still a little sick, so it kind of plays in. Rusher, I hate when you get sick. Don't get sick. Sorry, Mitch, you can get sick. Oh, God. Rusher, you can't. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> yeah. That was a little... He just rips on me. I know, like, he didn't have to add that part, but he did, you know? It's completely unnecessary and heartless. <laughs> oh, my God. Mitch, that is uh, that is the commenters' goodbye messages to you and uh, the two comments I chose to do today. Uh, Classic. Uh, Mitch is actually going to be heading out uh, right after the intro today. So, Mitch, I do have one task for us. We're going to have a little bit of fun before you go, okay? All right. All right, so uh, Napkin and Finn aren't, aren't able to be here, but they've built a – well, they're really working hard on player cannons. Uh, we've been trying oh, to have some God. fun with player <laughs> cannons, and – I, I thought it'd be a little bit fun today if you and I tested out these player cannons and uh, <laughs> see how far we can launch. Uh, again, they're kind of in uh, beginner stages. They're developing new ideas, etc. So, TP to me, we're at the, the cannon test zone right now outside of the border for the Archon. And right. we're going to come right over here. There's two cannons, all right? <laughs> right over so here, buddy. That's so intimidating. <laughs> okay, okay. So, this one right here. This one's a, a little bit glitchier, but it's the one that works the best. This is the, the forward propeller. So what you need is an ender pearl, and then the button's right here. You hit it, you go on the fence post, and you just jump. Boom! And then you oh, launch, man. and then you chuck the pearl, and then you land. 
Of course, if you were in the end, you need a gapple, and you can get about 120 blocks, dude, including the ender pearl. So pretty efficient, dude. What instead of what do ender pearls you think usually make? How far? Uh, I think 50 or 60 blocks. Yeah. So this is double it right here. Uh, hey, I did, didn't even launch. No, it didn't work. No, it doesn't work ah. every time. Try again. Try again. Jump on the fence post and hit the button. You got this, bitch. If I could do it, you sometimes can. Yeah, go fly, bitch, fly! <laughs> and you chuck the pearl and it gets you some distance too. So that that one's a work in process. Obviously, we need, uh, you know, get it more powerful. You know Finn and Napkin, they'll find a way, dude. When there's a will, there's a way. Now, Mitch, this one right here, this one's easier to use. This one's kind of just for fun. It's a straight-up propeller. You can get on here too, dude. Come on. Get on here. Let's have, let's have, this is the last time we can have fun together. Let's do yeah. it, bro. Let's do it. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Yeah! <laughs> Just two bros flying through the air, dude. <laughs> I love that. I love it. Well, Mitch, I'm going to move on with today's show and, you know, get into some actual faction stuff. I thought you'd love testing out those things before you That's head awesome. off. awesome. Have a great vacation, dude. When you get back, we're going to be like very very close like within a week to the finale so when you get nice. back make sure you're ready for some of the best moments you're going to experience on minecraft dude uh seriously have a good trip though we're all going to miss you and uh, i love you give me a hug buddy i'm going to miss you guys too uh come here oh, oh that's <laughs> nice just it just feels right it just feels right all right <laughs> see you dude i'm gonna walk this you way do. you walk that way oh. and it'll be like we're leaving each other see ya well, it's sad to see Mitch go. We've got some more plans for today, but before we do anything, I'm here with Mr. Ender Knight, a.k.a. Amass. How you doing today, buddy? Hey, dude. Good, thank you. Good thing. I'm also here with Vems and Napkin. This is the man who bought my head for $55 million and then gave it to Napkin, dude. And I'm here to ask, because lots of us were confused and no one really understands... What were your thoughts? Are you just generally a nice guy, or what's going on? I have a moment of being nice and not nice, just like you. <laughs> all right, all right, I feel you. Now, are you and Napkin bros? Because he defined your relationship as sort of friends. <laughs> oh, that's well, mean, that's mean. So, because, like, if you were... I would never give something worth $55 million to a sort of friend. What do you think of your relationship, Amass? No, it's a bit harsh sort of friends, isn't it? <laughs> it's a bit harsh now, kid. <laughs> no, 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 no. We're a little better than sort of friends. Oh, you're correcting yourself. You guys are you guys are friends. Even though Prologue is enemy to us, I think, right? Yeah, I think so still. Oh god, one of these another awkward situation. <laughs> I know you and Hawkett are like bet another thing we wanted to ask. Oh my god! Vems, are you what are you doing, Vems? What are you doing, Vems? Vems? Really? <laughs> Scared the crap out of me, dude. All right. Well, you guys battle out with her while I continue this. So, Mr. Mass, you are like really good friends with, with um, Hawkin, right? Yeah, I'm right. Yeah, yeah. So, where where is Hawkin? We haven't seen him on lately. Oh, he's been on holiday. He's been oh, on holiday. He's been on vacation. Okay, and he's gone for the rest of the season. Yeah, I think he comes back a week into that season. Okay, weekend, that's the end of the season. Okay, okay, so cool. I wanted to know that. And what's like the future of Prologue? Are you sticking with Prologue? Because right now, are you the leader of it or is Hawkins still, even though he's gone? Oh, you're the leader. Yeah. So are you guys sticking like that? Or are you joining different factions? What's your plan? I think we're planning on making Prologue quite big next season. I'm sticking with it. Okay, next season. Okay, so you're kind of planning for next season with about 20 episodes to go today. Vems, you... <laughs> Vems is leading that thing. So your excuse for giving it to Nat, were you trying to get anything out of Napkin, or just that was your nice guy day? That's my nice guy day. Nice guy day. He's got no excuse. Are you Are you that sad about Like, I just... Are you that sad about it? Like, that was, that's a lot of money. That's more money than I've ever had. $55 million for that head. I mean, I appreciate it, but... You, uh, like, are you sad to see that go? Did you, Napkin said you did want it back once you realized I liked it. <laughs> no, it's alright. It's a <laughs> Thank you. The man, a man with little words. Dude. So, 
Are you guys gonna fight right now or hug? What what's it, what's it gonna be? It's up there. Yeah. Hug. Uh, you feel a hug? <laughs> okay. You want a hug? You want a hug? Cause, right. Yeah, I, I feel I yeah. feel like you guys need a hug. Two very manly men hugging it out, bro to bro. Oh, that just feels right. Hey, hey, hey watch it, watch it, watch it now. Well, was a love tap. <laughs> Ender Knight, I guess, uh, or a mask. Thanks for giving me my head back. That that was good of you. We've burnt it now. There's no getting it back for you. And yeah, uh, I don't know. I I wanted to get to the bottom of it of why it happened, but I guess uh, the answer is you were trying to be a nice guy, and you don't want anything from Napkin for that. You were literally just being cool. Just being cool. Just being cool. All right, man. Well, it was nice to meet you. Nice to talk to you in person for the first time. And, uh, yeah, it's been good, boys. I'm going to get out of here. Vems, did you kill that wither? Yeah. I see you walking around in Viz, dude. It's creepy as heck. All right, boys. Uh, I'll see you later. Well, ladies and gents, now we move into a war. An organized war, actually. Uh, 35-ish versus 35, a 70-player war. We got Bulldog here in the call. He's the ref. He's counting down from 18 right now. Also, I'm here with Vems and Napkin in the call. And, yeah, uh, we need to all gather up, dude. I got Invis pots for everybody. We're going Team Invis this game, dude. Team Invis. Oh. <laughs> Where are you at, dude? I'm Where are you at? Well, everyone, I'm right in the middle. Okay, okay. What do we got? We got 12 seconds left. Uh, oh, you're in the middle of the castle? Yep, all, here, have some of that. Oh, Napkin, you're already Invis. Good, good, good. What do we got? Eight I seconds. I have a in my hand. All right, I got to I gotta drop a few of these. Boom, boom. I'm on an alt, by the way, ladies and gents. There's strength and speeds on the map. Three seconds, two, two one. one, Bulldog, thanks for counting down, and no uh, thanks for being our ref, dude. You can join your ref's call, and uh, yeah, shout out to Jcast for making this map as well. Ooh, I'm all invis. I'm all invis Later and boys. beautiful. All right, who do we got? So some of the people on the other team, no, that's an ally, that's an ally. I'm also in split for fun right now, because I didn't want to make it obvious this was my ult, and all right. So, boys, uh, who's on the other team? I don't know, actually. It's kind of weird, but I don't know. <laughs> Me neither, dude. It's like my brother's there, undefined. It seems like they're all kind of chilling back. I don't know. Boo Bear. Oh, this person's on Ryland's team. This person's on Ryland's So you guys are going to see me not get, as target, not get as targeted as much as I usually do because I'm on an alt. I don't have a freaking red name that blares. Uh, we may have a chance. Jcaz also was the one in charge of this. Thank you so much, Jcaz, for, for organizing this for us. Oh, baby, oh, baby, oh, baby, get him! Oh, no. So, people have lots of gear, and this is a fight to see who is the, the better side right now. I think Cameroon might recognize, dude, or he's got a grudge for uh for my certain alt right now. Come on, baby, come on, baby, come on. Oh, I'm pounding, I'm pounding, I need to gavel! How you boys doing? How you boys doing? Any problems so far? Decent, decent. Decent, yeah, all right, all right. How's the numbers? It, it, it's pretty even, I think. We, we spent a lot of time whitelisting to make sure the numbers are pretty even, so... It does come down to skills, sticking together, picking off clutch kills, armor, etc. Lots to do with armor, though, of course. And crits. Let's see, baby. Come on, Camrude. I want Camrude, man. I want Camrude. Getting 3v1 behind the castle. I'm okay, going I, I'm going to come help you out in a second. I'm pounding Camrude, though. I think I can pick this guy off shortly. They got lots of bow people, too. Is that, I'm going to try and pick off Boo Bear there. The people who are archering up top, they won't expect it. Oh, this is going to be an even fight, ladies and gents. Not too many people have fallen. Okay, I'm flanking. I'm flanking. I'm going above. I'm going above. Here we go, dude. This may or may not work. Fluffy, get out of here. What is with this fluffy guy? Oh, I think he knows it's my alt. Ah! Attack, dude. I'm attacking up top. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, dang it, dude. I, I stormed the archers up here. I stormed the archers. <laughs> I didn't pick one off. All right, boys. Where are you at? Where are you at? Me, Joe, are behind the castle with Kay. two others. Okay, okay, I'm gonna back out of enemy territory a bit. You gotta conserve your gear. I don't think this battle's gonna be a walk in a park, dude. This is gonna be a close one. How, how are the numbers over here? Maybe it just looked bad over there. Yeah, okay, we've got numbers in here. That might have been why. I'll hit Vems us. Vems is back here. Vems yeah. is back there, okay. Yeah, lots of their team is chilling in the back. Oh, oh I, I qualify. qualify. Who'd you get? Qualify? I qualify. Yeah, I qualify. Yeah, qualify. Nice job, oh boys. God, nice job. Camera is here. Ooh, I'm heading down, dude. Down into the depths. Oh, dude, I'm getting 3 v one underneath here, dude. They, Dude, undefined or whatever, they know it's me. They've been pounding me all game. I'm coming down. Okay. Yeah, I'm down in the cave. Oh, yeah, dude, I am in the cave getting absolutely pounded, dude. Even when I'm you're on an alt, dude, they target you when they have a hunch. I'm behind you, guys. All right, dude, I, I got the... I, I'm 
bowling him back right now. What's up, MVG? What's up, MVG? Stay back. Are you underneath there right now? Yep. Okay, I'm coming back down. All cellulose poked out. One sec. Domino, Domino, Domino! He doesn't have a gamble! He doesn't have a gamble! Yeah! Give me that kill! I'm gearing up, dude. I'm gearing up. Woo! Oh, he... I have a stack of gapples now, dude. Oh! Nice. <laughs> oh, clutch! There is the armor I need, dude. Oh, that's Let's get, let's get MV out of here. Uh, alright, alright. Who's this? Mr. Freeze. Oh, is this our teammate? Yeah, it is. Yeah, get up here, buddy. Gear up, gear up. You take the rest of it. Alright, Napkin, you, you trapped down there? Nope, I get up, I get up. Alright, good, dude, good. Oh, dude, that was clutch. I have a stack of gaps now. <laughs> that is the beauty of this war. If you make it into a war, you're either gonna lose everything you have, or you're gonna triple everything you have. Oh, baby. So that's what it is. If you don't get kills, you're gonna run out of armor, because no one's got over a full inventory of armor, dude. Alright, Domino's down. Always remember your gapple, especially with the Archon leg now being fixed. You get killed pretty quickly. You can see his helmet broke. He was down in a second. Get him in this little corner here. This is where I killed my last person. MVG! MVG! Oh! <laughs> he slaps his helmet on in the nick of time. It looks like we have numbers, ladies and gentlemen, and we may pull off this win. Still got a couple of their strong guys left. Camrude's still alive. Let's bow boost up to him and see if we can get him. Come on, Wild. Let's do it. I'm your faction member right now. I'm in pride or split for fun. Sell you this chest blade and he falls again, dude. I did not get the finishing blow, though. Who's trying to pick up gear? We got to make sure they don't get any extra gear. It'll just delay the process even longer. Dude, there's a big hole in this map. I'm jumping off. No, I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> That's a bad idea. <laughs> All right, who we got? I think there's about five... Five to seven of them left. Uh, just over 40 people. I'm not sure. I don't know how many we've lost. They've got MVG left still, Mr. Freeze. We've lost a few Vems. You've died, right? Yeah. Uh, it's all right, little buddy. You fought hard out there. There's a guy inside yeah. of our castle, Binksy. All right, I'm fighting Zero Arsenal right now inside here. Another one bites the dust, if I do say so myself. Napkin, you were a part of this? A little bit. A couple hits. A little bit. A couple hits. You slayed him, dude. Few more left. They're falling fast. Flame of Dude is not on our team. Don't let him pick up this gear. He's trying to run right through. We got Zero Arsenal, Flame of Dude, Crane Noob. Uh, still a few enemies left to demolish. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here. Oh! <laughs> Come on! I just can't luck out with these ones, dude. Arsenal is switching gear like I've never seen before. Uh, I think we've got a count of three of them left. Angry Chicken, Arsenal, and Flame of Dude are the. Uh, the alive members on the enemy team. That's all we got left to deal with. Yes! And he dies! The thing with these wars, dude, is why you see so many blowouts is because it's really exponential because, like, like I said, once you get gear, you just keep getting more gear, keep getting more kills, and you become more immortal with every single kill your team gets. You guys just picked off the final guy. Who was it, Flama? No, Avery. Avery, right? Avery. Okay, so there it is, guys. The war is over. We we do have less than 20 people left alive, so it wasn't crazy blowout, because I think one time in the war, uh, we had, like, every single member still alive, but today, I, I think we lost almost half of our people, or it depends how many we started with, so we lost around 10 people at least. So good fight, Good war. Uh, they're usually a lot quicker. Kind of montage -y. I hope you guys are cool. Let me know, though, in the comments. Do you guys enjoy these wars? Do you want us to put wagers on these wars? I've, all, I've been debating the last couple wars. You've seen them a lot less frequent because I don't know how you feel about them. And they tend to bring uh, some very negative people into it, uh, like exterior things uh, outside of factions, uh, if you know what I mean. So, I don't know. Let, let me know in the comments. I, I do want to hear and napkin vems and the entire new demic team we've done well today still a couple more things to take care of before we head off today one of them being we have not went to home head in a fair amount of time it still exists yes i just haven't we we haven't got too many heads lately and if we have we we've ended up selling them actually i think mav may have a couple of the heads that we need and he'll be back from vacation for the next episode hopefully maybe two episodes from now but until then, I do have one head, and it's Shane Dog's head. Shane Dog, if you didn't know, is one of the six 
general uh, accounts here on Factions Platinum, only available through the, the crate key, of course. Um, so it's a big prize. We don't even really have a set of general gear. But the reason I wanted to focus on this guy right here is he hasn't been a huge part of the, the show. He hasn't gotten involved too much. He is going on the, the normal head wall over here. But I do want to question. I don't know if he plays much anymore. I want to get some uh, some general gear. I want to. I don't know if this uh, this would be the right guy because Shane Dog. Uh, I know most of the. Is that even his his name? Shane Dog. Oh, it's with an E too. Oh, what the heck's going on here? All right, I'm extremely confused. Those are the exact same names, but it won't f who for me. Either way, maybe he changed his name or something. Who knows? But, uh, yeah, Shane Doc. He's a, he's a general. We need general gear, so I'm trying to orchestrate some sort of plan for general gear because it would not, it'd be nice to march into the final battle, episode 600, with some, you know, with some beautiful gear. We need to show confidence, pride, uh, intimidation. Now, those are three things that we need in order to increase our chances of winning a war and just to feel good. So, I don't know. We are going to be looking at some of the generals. And I'm going to start learning some things about them, their friends, etc. Uh, i got to find out which ones are on our team or not, though. But either way, we need the gear, and we're going to stop at nothing to get it. Also, Jake Aruksha, uh, you know, we're, we're not ignoring him yet. Don't, don't worry, ladies and gents. He's going to pay. I, I'm so mad at him still, losing two of my heads because of that guy. Um, yeah. It's, it's going to be a long haul for him. He's got a long 20 episodes, or 19, I guess, to go. We're getting closer and closer, baby. But with that, ladies and gentlemen, I think we are going to wrap up today's video. Uh, I know we're all going to miss Mitch, but don't worry. He will be back just before episode 600. So we'll have him for that final duel, that final crazy... Oh, God. <laughs> there is so much planned for episode 600. My mind can barely prepare for it. I have, like, everything written down and... All my plans and strategics, everything kind of laid out because there's so much happening that day. It's going to be crazy. Lots of things to tie up before we get there. We've got just over two weeks to do it. And uh, yeah, things are really going to start heating up in the next few days once uh, Dylan and D-Field are back from vacation. Obviously, in the end, those are our, our two main enemies in the big scheme of things. Those are the two we need to take down in the end. And I've got a way to do it. Stick around. Factions is going to continue to heat up over the next few days. Join us. PvP.thearchon.net is the server IP. Recent five donators, iLego PvP, Beta Test, Cool Matt, FC Silver, and Uber Studios. Thank you for your purchases to the Archon. Good luck on those crate keys, unique, golden, or normal, and enjoy your ranks. Have a beautiful day, everybody. Join the rush by subscribing. Touch that like button if you enjoyed. Leave a comment down below. We'll see you all later. Goodbye.